Okay, we are recording. So this is our team call for August 2nd, first one of August. I can't believe it's August already. And I'm excited to have Jessica on the call. This is your first call you've been on. Yay. <laughs> Yay. Okay, so a little bit of recognition. Um, first of all, we had a couple of rank advancements, actually two rank advancements um, in July. Holly, uh, your husband, Tobin, advanced to Emerald, so that was exciting, and Jessica, our new coach, advanced to Emerald um, super fast, like, I mean, it was like a week or something, so congratulations to you, um, so that's exciting, hopefully we have a lot more rank advancements coming up, because um, Team Cup is this month, so it's always a great time to advance. Um, success club points. We had a lot of people that had success club points. So between one and four points, uh, for July, we have Winnie Rose, Margaret Smith, Christy Davis, Shelly Uberoth, Brie Edwards, Lindsay Tibbs, Julie Keller, Elizabeth Romine, Meredith Kepler. There are a couple new names on that list, so that's always good. Um, SC5 to SC10. We had Jessica Paschal. Am I saying your name right, Jessica? Your last name? Paschal? Pascal? She's muted. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, it's always loud here. <laughs> it's Pascal. Pascal? Pascal. Okay. Cool. Yeah, just plain Pascal. It okay. looks fancy, but it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Pascal. Good deal. Um, so Jessica, I think you had I think she had eight. Um, you had Jamie Harris, Stacy Wilkinson, Holly Elliott, Rhonda Dyer, Elise Zilstra, and Rihanna Hoke. Um, and then SC 10 plus was myself. I almost forgot to put myself on the list. Uh, Suzanne Santi and Bethany Bacon. I think Bethany had 12. I think she was the top one this month. So congratulations to everybody. Everybody on here on this call was on the list. So that's a good thing. <laughs> um, we did great last month and this month I know with the country heat release is going to be hopefully even better and bigger. It should be awesome. So, um, I am going to actually share my screen and we're just going to get right into announcements and everything from summit. So let me see if I can share this here. Alrighty. Can you guys see the little PowerPoint thing? Yes. Okay, cool. It is nothing fancy at all. I literally whipped this up in like five minutes today. So, Post summit recap. I'm going to see what this does. Okay, good. I can still see you guys. I didn't know what that would do. Okay, so we have a ton of challenge pack promos. I don't know if you guys have actually looked at the FAQ for this or not. Um, Country Heat, of course, is on promotion for 140. And let's see, the Country Heat Kickstart. Um, which any of the Kickstart challenge packs just include the Shakeology and the three-day refresh. So the Kickstart is 180. So that one, of course, is on promotion this month. And then they threw in all of these other ones at $140, every single one of these. That is amazing. Like, never have I ever seen this many challenge packs at $140 at the same time. And when I was looking at the FAQ, I know Stacy pointed this out to me, when I was looking at the FAQ, the takedown dates for all of these specials aren't until like the beginning of November. So I think all of these should be at the $140 price for August, September, and October, if I'm reading that right. Like that's the way that the FAQ reads, which is amazing. So anyway, we also have the 21 day fix and Fix Extreme Challenge Packs with Shakeology for 140, and then those kickstarts are 180. The 22-Minute Hardcore with Shakeology is 140, or you can get it with um, the Performance supp Supplements for 140. Those come with the sandbag and the containers, which is awesome. I love that sandbag. Um, the Size Challenge Pack with Shakeology is 140. The Kickstart is 180. The Three-Day Refresh is 140. The with the kickstart is, which I don't know why you would need a three-day refresh kickstart. That makes not a lot of sense to add three-day refresh to three-day refresh. But anyway, it says there's a kickstart challenge back for $180. I'm not exactly sure <laughs> what that means. Um, the club challenge pack, which is your club membership, 90 days of club, 
plus Shakeology, and they're throwing in the containers is also 140, and then that Kickstart is 180, and the Pio Challenge Pack is 140, and the Kickstart is 180. So that is a whole lot of sales. I mean, that is amazing. So promote the heck out of all that stuff this month, and we will talk about something else that's coming up that is just going to be incredible as a promotion too. I think everybody's going to get on board. So those are our promotions. And then of course, again, uh, country heat and Suzanne and I did the country heat live certification at summit. Oh my gosh. It was so much fun. And I know when the program first released or when they first told us about it back, I don't know, earlier in the year, I don't even remember what it was. Um, I kind of thought, you know, a line dancing workout, like this is so not going to be cool. And I really was not into it. And until I started doing it and really giving it a chance and at summit, holy cow, like it was so much fun and we were sweating our guts out. I mean, really after just doing one 30 minute routine, sweating like crazy. And I did that again today. And so it really is going to be a really good workout. The test group got incredible results and I really think it's going to be something for everybody. And that's kind of an, a program that we don't have, you know, I mean, size was kind of supposed to be for everybody, but the choreography is really complicated and a lot of people can't get that. Um, Pio was supposed to be like this beginner routine, but there are a lot of beginners that I had that couldn't do Pio and got really discouraged because they weren't flexible enough and they couldn't hold poses. And so it was just a lot harder than we thought it was going to be. But Country Heat is going to be for everybody, seriously. So promote the heck out of it. It's awesome. Okay, next one, Core de Force. And these were pictures that I actually just took while I was at <laughs> um, the opening ceremonies that night. Core de Force, this is a brand new program um, from Joel and Jericho. So if you guys don't know who Joel and Jericho are, um, they both used to be with Les Mills, and they did – Les Mills Combat and Les Mills Pump. Um, or I think Joel did Pump and Jericho did Combat. But they left Les Mills a while back and they came to Beachbody like last year. And um, they've been kind of dabbling in a little bit, um, a, a couple of little programs, niche programs that are on demand. And they finally are coming out with Core de Force. So what is it? It is a martial arts type program. Lots of, you know, kickboxing, kicking, punching, uh, using your core, using your obliques a lot. Um, it's supposed to blast fat and carve your waist. Um, it is 30 days, no equipment. There will be um, a DVD and it will be on demand and it should release November 1st. Uh, so that's exciting. It looks, it looks pretty cool for people that really like kickboxing style. Um, it looks like it's pretty fast paced. Um, it's those type workouts typically have some impact. So you might be careful when you're talking to somebody with like, you know, knee and ankle injuries and things like that. It might be a little hard um, or they might just be able to modify. So kind of heads up on that. But that's quarter force coming out November 1st. Um, all right, next. And this looks interesting. Three week yoga retreat. So it is supposed to be beginner level yoga. And the first week is your foundation week. Um, which is just the very basic of uh, the poses and kind of, I think the basic theory of yoga. Um, the second week is called expansion. The third week is called progression. Um, there are 21 classes. There are 30 minutes or less each. Um, on Saturdays, they have a relax class. That's all it said on the FAQ. So I really don't know what that means. Um, <laughs> I guess it's a lower intensity um, class. And then on Sunday, they have, it said they have like a couple of different 10 minute yoga workouts to pick from for Sunday. So you have a shorter day on Sunday. Uh, there are four different trainers. They're all new to Beachbody. They're not anybody that we've seen before. Um, it is going to be on demand only and it will be free to Beachbody on demand members. So anybody that is an on demand member, this will show up in their member library. Um, there's no digital unlock for it or anything like that. Um, but it will go, it will release in September of this year. Um, it seemed, you know, kind of interesting. And one of the points that Carl really wanted to focus on, um, you know, at Summit, apparently this whole thing is filmed just on a white background. Like it's not, 
any, you know, yoga on the beach or yoga in a studio with, you know, yoga stuff all around. Like he wanted it to be a blank slate of yoga. So the people that have any kind of preconceived notions about what yoga is with candles burning and, you know, chanting and whatever you do with yoga. I don't know. I don't do yoga, but, um, like none of that is in this. It is just, you go through the basic yoga poses and you learn the yoga itself without having all of, you know, what some people kind of think might be, um, different, we'll say mindsets or I don't know, you know, just different <laughs> notions that some people have about yoga. You know, he, he did not want any of that in this program. It's just a clean slate. You learn your yoga poses, you stretch, you breathe, that kind of thing. So I think that's a pretty cool take on it because I'm one of those people that's like, I, I'm not going to sit there and like do alms. I'm just yeah. not. <laughs> so that could be pretty cool. Next on the list, Fixate. They're doing a Fixate TV show on VOD, on Beach Friday On Demand. It is coming, I think, in a couple of weeks. Let's see. August 18th should be the first episode. Um, there's going to be one episode a week, and each episode will be four to seven minutes long, and it will be one recipe that they make per episode. It's Autumn and her brother. Her brother is a professional chef, and so she pretty much challenged him to be like, look, you know, you make these amazing recipes, but can you make them, you know, 21 day fix approved? And can you use these ingredients? And he did it. So they've got really great recipes that actually use 21 day fix ingredients. She gives you the grocery list, the recipes, the container equivalents, everything. And she's going to give like, you know, kind of fun facts about why you're using say this particular grain or this particular vegetable and fun facts about um, that particular ingredient and why it is, you know, so beneficial to your health basically. So I think that'll be really cool. And I think that's something that's going to create a lot of extra added value on Beachbody on demand, you know, for people that have club memberships or, um, you know, helping our new customers, especially 21 day fix it, heck any of our customers, you know, that need to learn some new recipes and learn how to, cook, you know, the basics of this kind of cooking and meal prep and that sort of thing. Um, so I think it'll be pretty cool. Um, let's see, this is the next one. And this is what I am so super, super excited about. Beachbody is doing a million dollar Beachbody health bet. It's going to be in September. This is going to be huge guys. I've heard of people doing these little health bets and people getting all excited about it. Um, whether it's just with a group of friends or whatever it is, um, this is actually going to be a million dollar giveaway. It's going to start at a million dollars. And then for every challenge pack that is sold now through, let's see, August 31st, I think. Um, yes. From now through August 31st, actually from July 27th through August 31st, they're going to add $5 to the pot up to $3 million. And what people do to enter you have your own little challenge groups. Um, it will be tracked in the My Challenge Tracker app. And I do not know yet, I need to find out if we can do our own little challenge groups or our own groups on the tracker or if there's one big group that people need to take part in. They kind of made it seem like we're doing our own little groups and that somehow they can track that, but I'm not sure. We need more info on that part. Um, but they will have to log a minimum of three workouts a week and five shakes a week. Um, plus they're supposed to put a photo of them on their shake. Um, and everybody that does that basically wins and like splits the pot. The pot will get split among all the people that meet those qualifications. Um, that could be pretty cool. That could potentially be a whole lot of money. Um, and just a whole lot of people that are actually getting involved. So the challenge um, on the app will begin on September 5th is when we have to have our groups ready. So I'm planning on this being our September challenge group because, I mean, that's just huge. So in August, we'll pretty much do um, – well, I think I've got this on the next slide, actually. But, yeah, big, big deal. Super excited about that. I think that will be – I think it'll be easy to get people into really. I mean, that's just a cool promotion. So, 
Do you use that app? I have before. Um, I haven't a whole lot because people haven't really engaged with it a whole lot, but I think if we're making them, I think they will. Okay. It's, it's got a lot of really cool features because, um, you know, you can add pictures. You can basically run it just like a challenge group, except mm -hmm. that people don't have to be on Facebook. They just load the app on their phone and you can do everything on your phone, but they log their workout every day. They log their Shakeology every day and you can actually see what they log. Oh. Um, you can see what every person has or has not logged. So that's kind of cool to help, you know, keep track of your people and kind of stay on top of them. Like, Hey, you haven't done your workout yet today. And it's <laughs> a reminder that you can set. Um, like say you set your reminder for 7 PM. It'll send you a little notification. Like you haven't logged anything today. Did you do your workout? Mm. And so that's kind of cool. Um, but you can upload files into it. Um, you can upload like, you know, recipes, meal plans, pictures, um, all that kind of stuff. And you can use it as basically as a group where you're logging all of your, you know, nutrition and everything every day. Um, it has kind of like a news feed kind of thing too. So it's actually pretty cool. Can they c keep track of their containers on it? No. Okay. Last time I looked at it, they could not. Okay. And I don't think they've changed that yet or updated that. They can keep track of like weight and measurements and those kind of stats. Okay. Um, I do not think it has the containers on there at this point. Okay. Okay. So yeah, they would still need the little 21 day fix app or something for that. So yeah. And that one's free. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, and this is really pretty easy to set up. Every coach has access to it. You just go to, there should be an FAQ on it, and there's a coach portal that you go to on your computer um, to set it up, and then you can upload the app on your phone, and it kind of has all your groups set up on there. So, and you invite people, like people have to be invited to the group and that kind of thing. Okay. Um, but yeah, it's, it's pretty easy to use, so, okay. yep. This was just another cool slide that Carl talked about that I thought was really interesting about how many people there are left to help. So these are 2015 numbers, and if I'm remembering correctly exactly what he was saying, basically Beachbody helped 2.8 million people in 2015. The fitness industry as a whole helped 58 million people, and then these are the dollar equivalents of what that equaled out to. But going by the number of people that are – you know, overweight and obese in just our country, in just the United States, and of course, subtracting this number, um, that leaves 226 million people that are still out there that need our help. And so I think Carl's point with this was that a lot of people, you know, keep saying, well, you know, everybody knows Beachbody coach now, you know, everybody's heard of Beachbody now. Well, there's still a huge number of people that need our help. So it's no excuse for us to you know, talk about, oh, well, the market's, you know, saturated with coaches because it's not, you know, it just takes us doing the work and actually getting out there and talking to people, you know, and reaching out to people. Um, these are our customers, people that need us. And, you know, honestly, in my opinion, the number's higher than that because people that might be even in a quote unquote healthy weight range, that doesn't mean that you're healthy. You know, I mean, you can be, I mean, like me, I wasn't technically ever overweight, but I was not healthy either, you know, and I needed major changes with my nutrition to make me feel better, you know, and that was my big thing. And I know that's the case for a lot of people too. So to me, this number is way higher than that because everybody needs to be at their healthiest, I, I mean, yeah, regardless of what the number on the scale is. Everybody needs to be healthy and everybody needs good nutrition. So, um, but that was kind of his point that we still have a lot of people to reach. So get out there and get to work. All right. Now this is exciting. And I think everybody on this call is actually already registered, um, which is awesome. We had so much fun this year and next year it's going to be in new Orleans. Um, I love the logo. Love the logo. My whole family's from New Orleans, so um, that'll be kind of fun. But if you haven't gotten your ticket yet, which I think everybody on this call has, but this $175 ticket is still on sale until August 7th. Um, 
spread the word that everybody needs to get that because this is the lowest price that it will be. It will just go up from here. So get your ticket. Um, Suzanne and I got some rooms yesterday. I don't know if y'all saw that ridiculously long thread that we had going in that message. We were kind of freaking out, but what we ended up doing, um, Suzanne has one room and I got five rooms at the Royal St. Charles or something like that. It's right by the convention center and really close to the Superdome, which is where everything's going to be. Um, so we have six total rooms that are reserved. Um, so we're just going to leave it at that for now. That's, you know, we can fit a lot of people in six rooms. So, um, you know, heck we fit 12 people in two rooms this year. So <laughs> it was quite fun. Um, but anyway, so we have rooms, so I don't think anybody else needs to worry about getting any. Um, so we should be good to go So get registered for New Orleans. One of the, one of the big things for me, let me even go back. You know, summit has got, amazing training sessions that we all go to and you know we hear all these super inspirational speakers and these top coaches that have done so much and truly I mean changed their lives in so many ways which I think has just changed all of our lives honestly or we wouldn't be here we wouldn't be doing this you know um, it doesn't matter on what scale um, but one of the biggest things for me every single year that I've been to summit for me, it's not about all the workshops. I mean, we can get all kinds of training, you know, from multiple different places. It is us being there with our team, really, truly getting to know everybody, bonding with everybody. Um, you know, and just, I don't know, that's what's so much fun. And everybody always has these big aha moments, like, you know, something just clicks. And it's that kind of stuff that is so cool about Summit. You're in this atmosphere of just, so much excitement and ambition from everybody and everybody's talking about how hard you have to work. And, um, I don't know, it's just a really cool environment to be in. And to me, that is, that's the most important part about summit. And that's why you just, you gotta be there. Um, it's hard to, to feel that even, you know, when you go back and watch the trainings, which they're great, but it's that energy that's there at summit that is the most important part. So anyway, Okay, so post summit momentum. So what I want everybody to do, I want you all to really write down your goals of what you want to accomplish for the rest of the year. Lay it out there, be specific, and I want you to kind of think big, like go for big rank advancements, go for crazy amounts of SC points, go for, which I was gonna say, go for helping a ridiculous amount of people that translates into crazy numbers of SC points. It's the same thing. Um, really go for it, you know? Get on Z if you haven't yet. It is amazing as far as organizing your power hour, organizing your contacts, telling you who you need to talk to. Oh, sorry, how do you on? <laughs> telling you who you need to talk to each day. And it's a great way to keep up with your follow-ups so that you don't lose track of people. Um, there's a free 30-day trial on it. And then after that, it's like $29 a month. But for me, honestly, it is the best business investment I've ever made. Um, it keeps you on track. Um, work hard. I have this on here because I don't think you could even hear any of this in the live streaming, but there were a couple different speakers um, in our general sessions. Gary Vaynerchuk was one of them. He is a big time like social media guru. He wrote the book, Jab, 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 Right Hook. And he just, he knows so much about all these different social media platforms and is really on top of things, but kind of his underlying message was you got to get out there and work your butt off really for anything that you want to do, anything that you want to be successful in, whether it's a regular job, whether it's coaching, whether it's schoolwork, no matter what it is, like the people that are going to succeed and do really well and get ahead are the ones that are going to work their tails off. And that was really the underlying point of his message. And it's true. And then like the very next day, Melanie Mitro, who is the top coach in the whole company going on three years, and she was in 2014, 2015, and I think she's still ranked number one for 2016, and she's like 30 um, or 32 or something. I know she's younger than me. Um, I mean, she got out there and made a, gave a talk on kind of what she's done to have so much success, and her whole point was 
she hasn't done anything special. She's just a regular person, just like every one of us. It's just that she seriously committed to it. She got up at five o'clock every morning before the kids got up, you know, before she had to do all sorts of other work and she worked her butt off. And that's how she became so successful. She said, basically, I was willing to work harder than the competition was, you know, and that's really what it boils down to. And so, you know, I just kind of wanted to bring that up because that came up multiple times throughout this summit. Like all of the top coaches um, were saying the same thing. It just comes down to hard work. This is not something that's easy. Um, And that's okay. Most things aren't easy. Most good things are not easy things. And that hard work is really going to pay off if you just put the time in. So um, that's kind of my sacrifice your time for a couple of years to reap the rewards. That's what I've been doing. That's what I did last year, especially. I worked my tail off last year, you know, so that when Kenzie was born and for the first few months of her life while I was figuring out this whole mom thing, I could kind of take a step back, you know, and not have to work so much. So um, anyway, just wanted to kind of point that out. Um, okay. So challenge groups for the month right now, we've got our multi-program, um, what's it called? Time for you challenge running that just started. We've got a country heat challenge group. That's going to start on the 15th. Oh, sorry. I don't think I'm breathing enough. I'm talking too fast. (laughs) And then we have all of those, you know, tons of challenge pack specials going on. (laughs) <laughs> you made everybody on. do what you made everybody on yeah, I wasn't even looking at you guys um so in September we're gonna have this health bet challenge I'm thinking of starting it you know right on the first or whenever that first Monday is so utilize all of these amazing challenge pack specials that we have going on this month um to get people into this health bet challenge because it's gonna be huge um so anyway and then basically just Don't give up on what you want. That was another big theme of Summit. Um, Keep on working. Just keep on pushing. Keep going. Um, And that will get you to where you want to be, where you need to be. So that's basically it. I just wanted to kind of give you guys a recap of everything. Um, Do you have questions about any of that? I do. Yes. Um, Okay. You said, I put in my notes, August 18th for the... Um, fixate stuff. Nineteenth. Nineteenth. Mm-hmm. Okay. I think they said that a new episode would release every Friday, so I'm assuming the nineteenth is a Friday. Okay, every Friday, August. Okay. I think that's what they said. Yeah. And they're about fifteen twenty minutes. She said, right? Mm-mm. Just four to four to seven minutes is what the FAQ said. Yeah, so I think they're pretty short. Okay. And good to send to people, you know, just like, Hey, this is a short little cooking demonstration. You know what I mean? Can we send them when some people have to buy them if they they're paying for on demand? Mm, Good point. Seems like that would be. Yeah. I don't know if we can't, if we will be able to send them. Probably not downloadable. So more of a reason to get more people on demand. (laughs) So access to them. (laughs) True. Now, yeah. will that yoga, three-week yoga thing be free on on-demand? Two on-demand members, yes. Okay. If you are a club member and have on-demand, yep. It won't be a digital unlock or anything. It will just be free to on-demand members. Okay. Yep. And how much should I start saving for when the hotel is split in New Orleans? Oh, well, this year it's probably going to be around 250 300 a person. For the, was it four days? Four for nights? the whole, yeah, not per night. Okay. Um, let me see here. I want to say I calculated up like three to 350 once we get everything and split everything. It's 170, let's see. It's 175 a night times five nights times six rooms. Divide it by, I'm going to say, I'm going to guess like 16 people, just as a guess. Okay. That would be 328. If, whoops. If there's like 20 people there, it'll be like 260 a person. 
Okay. We split it between everybody. So it kind of depends on how many people we end up having. But I mean, I would kind of say maybe say 350 just to be on the safe side. Okay. You know? And then the 175, that's just basically your entrance fee, right? That doesn't cover anything, just getting in the door. Oh, for Summit. That's your ticket. Yeah. So okay. That's your actual ticket to Summit. Okay. And, um, yeah, but that's, I mean, that's your, your entry to all the workshops, you know, the opening and closing ceremonies, like that's the workouts, like all of that stuff. Okay. Now, like lunches and things like that are not included. They will have the option for you to purchase box lunches. Okay. Which I always do because it's so much easier than having to go and find some place to eat when you've got like an hour, you know, right. they have yeah, it it healthy. Oh yeah. They're actually really good. Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah. Every year I've been anyway, they've been really good and healthy. Okay. Um, so really it's the 175, it's the hotel, your food and parking. Mm -hmm. Those are your main bills. Okay. And core, that's your main bill. <laughs> That's what Bethany said. Unless you have a whole lot of self-control. <laughs> I mean, like, you walk into court, seriously, this year, it was a 14,000 square foot room that core was in. And yeah. it's got every little section, like, there's a section for 21 Day Fix, 21 Day Fix Extreme, Country Heat, Pio, P90X, um, Insanity, Turbofire. Like, everything has a section and has all of the workout clothes like all of the gear for each program and you go in and it's like, Oh my God, everything's so awesome. <laughs> sale prices or anything? It is every year I've been, it's been 25% off. Okay. So there is a bit of a sale price versus like just getting it when you get home online, you know, right. so there is that benefit this weekend, it actually happened to be, you know, how Tennessee has a tax free weekend before school starts back up every year. Tax free weekend hit while some it was going on. So that was nice. So we got 25% off plus no tax. So that was good. I don't know. I had no idea if Louisiana does that. Probably not. Um, but I don't know. Missouri does. Yeah. So, but it is 25% off. So okay, that's a bonus. Um, it's just, it's really hard not to go crazy in there because you see everything and everybody's just like grabbing everything. And <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> I'm such a bargain shopper. I could probably have maybe some willpower, but yeah. Do they sell decals like for your car? I've always wanted something to put on my car. I've never seen decals. What they did have this year and I actually got was a license plate thing. Oh, and it's cute. I mean, it's very simple. It just says in blue, it's got beach body on the top. And it says decide, commit, succeed along the bottom. And that's it. So it's like most of it's silver and then blue where the words are. And then I think the letters are in white or something. Um, so that was the first time I had seen anything for the car. And so I got that. Um, you know where they have decals though? Have you ever gone on the Cafe Press website? Um, yeah. Through Beachbody, you mean? Through Beachbody. Yeah. Yes. I want to say they have stickers for Thank different you. programs. I mean, you could use those as things for your car, I guess. I want that kind of magnet kind that you see oh. people doing and they could take it off so no one steals okay. it. Yeah. Cafe, anyway. Press, Cafe Press might have those. I don't know. Okay. I mean, that would be the place to look though. Cause I've never seen any of those like actually through Beachbody. The summer is the first time I've actually had a car I would put any kind of advertisement on. So, <laughs> yeah, okay. I had this plan in my mind. I would love to have a paddleboard like that's pretty blank, you know, and just have a whole bunch of beach body decals on it. I thought, you know, if I could get into like paddleboard racing or something that that to me would be super fun. Um, and like, I mean, it wouldn't be sponsored by beach body or anything, but have like, stickers of all the different programs like all over a paddleboard it's like that would be kind of cool <laughs> so i talked to the guy down in florida that makes paddleboards um yolo is one of the local brands down there he's like hey would you make me a board you know he's like i can make you whatever you want whatever you want on it or don't want on it it's like all right so it's in the back of my mind for later <laughs> but any other questions? Oh, there's some chat stuff. It's me. Oh, it's you. Okay. 
Yep. So that, that would be the main things. Um, Summit is one of those things, like, I mean, seriously, I lost three pounds at Summit. And it's because you are running around like a crazy person and you have no time to eat. But that's usually that what we... Every year. That's usually what I coach people not to do because your body holds on to it. I know. I know. But that's just, it's what happens every single year that I've been. I lose between five and three pounds, three and five pounds. Um, Can everyone hear you and I, Kim? They're all yeah. muted. Yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> they can hear us. But uh, do you have any input on that, Rhonden, since you were there? Or Bethany? Input on what? I totally missed that. Just summon it. <laughs> Are you at work? I'm at my other job now. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. No, I was just saying any input on, like, um, what to save up for Summit? Um, yeah, I had a whole budget for Summit, and that kind of went out the window when I got to core, so. Yeah, see, own, I guess. core, um, yep. Core broke my bank. <laughs> but it's a tax write-off for the business. Yes. Everything that's, that you buy. That's, that was my mantra, me and Christy, that was our mantra all weekend. This is a tax write-off. Tax write-off. <laughs> The only way you can buy clothes and actually write them off on taxes. Uh -huh. That's just 15%. Right? Better than that. That helps. Yep. So. <laughs> Bethany, anything to add? I see you. I can't see you, but I think you're on there. <laughs> you know, she only ever pops up the last five seconds. <laughs> Like, seriously, we get the little head icon the whole time, and then at the last minute, she she'd be like, bye. <laughs> For the picture. Yeah. Yep. Well, all righty. Any other questions about anything coming out? Summit in general? Anything? Um, keep people put, keep putting people in the ongoing on fire fitness. Mm -hmm. How long will that go? Just indefinitely? Yeah, that's just kind of the whole year kind of thing. Okay. I usually kind of start a new one going one every year, but that's kind of this year's. Um, okay. As far as other groups, I need to close out the Bod Before Breakfast and the July Fix. Um, enroll those people, you know, well, we all need to, you know, roll our own people into the On Fire for Fitness group. Um, okay. And I'll close out the Food, Fun, and Fitness or whatever that was. Okay. Yep. Um, I think Suzanne and Ashley have a step challenge that they're inviting people to right now. So I want to say Ashley posted something about that um, in Health of Fire a day or two ago. She did. Um, so that'll be a good free one. I want to say it's next week. Um, Does it have any recipes or any other benefit? I don't know. I okay. think it was just kind of like get off the couch and get some steps in. Like, you know, something just nice and easy and simple for people to get involved with. Um, without having them, you know, be super detailed on anything. So, I honestly have not looked at the group very closely yet. Okay. So, yep, I think that's all that's going on now. I'm going to um, get the winner from the Coach Expo, post it tonight. I just got all those numbers done. So, I'll get that oh. up. Did any other? I have another one starting that soon. Okay. I'm supposed to do it today, but it's okay if she missed that part. Yeah. Did any of you guys have any coaches that actually enrolled from that expo? No. No? Okay. I'm excited about my free canister. Oh, I know. That'll be, I love my canisters. It'll be good to have another one. So. <laughs> well, alrighty then. Well, I will quit recording and... Um